Hey guys, just Damu here with another Army Man toy review, and today I'm reviewing zombie figures. This is pretty cool. They're pretty much your two-inch standard figures. These are made of a really, really soft, rubbery plastic. So they're not brittle whatsoever. You could step on them and you would actually survive, and they would probably survive. There is one downside in that some of them have trouble standing because of how much they're leaning. That's leaning quite a bit right there. Some of them I set against the wall just because they did not want to stand. But you can run them under hot water, straighten them, then run them under cold water, and re-solidify them into a better position. Which also means you could sort of, you know, twist their arms and things possibly to keep a pose different than their standard pose. This plastic's pretty malleable if you know how to work it with hot water and cold water like that. So the cover of the sculpts, there's 14 different sculpts. However, I should note that you may not always get all 14. This package, for instance, has this guy and this guy who are the same. This is one set up here, another set right here. I'm covering each of our little zombies, you can see they kind of come in a silvery gray and a darker gray. Both are silver somewhat to a degree, though. They've got lots of scary mouth detail. I at first thought that these were just kind of sculpts I'd seen before, but it turned out that they were just similar. Some of them. They're very, they're their own unique set. There's only 14 pieces in a set, and you can find these at the Dollar Tree. They're in the regular toy section, so they don't seem to be a seasonal item, but as the dollar store goes, you know, it's only there until it's not. One's got a hole in his back. He's been shot. He's still moving. That one's pretty scary. And, you know, this virus actually is, uh, dogs are vulnerable, so watch out for Fido. They look similar, but they are different. Looks like a lady running until you're like, ah, no, it's not. Come down to the ground. Pretty spooky. Got two different, you know, headstones, and lady who's running for her life, except that no, maybe not. Looking kind of dead. A very nice zombie set. Yeah. Uh, the only thing I wish is that it came in like that, that light green. I think zombie figures always look good in light green. It just kind of brings them to life. Whereas silver and gray, it's it's a good dead color, I suppose. Just uh, just not my favorite. I hope to use these in a Army Men vs. Zombies stop motion someday far, far away. And uh, when I do, I'll probably end up spray painting them light green. Just to make them match all my other zombie figures. For a buck, it's a good buy. If you're looking to get a quantity, you are going to have to spend several bucks. But, they're nice. They, they really are. I like them. Recommended. Ding! Well, I hope you enjoyed the toy review. Make sure to like, favorite, and subscribe as I post a new toy review just about every other day. I post a new Army toy review every Friday. And please follow me on Facebook, Joshua Gandamu. There's a link for that down below in the more info area. And I'll see you guys next time.